I'm gonna be spending the night here today. It's been a beautiful day, but as soon as the sun went down, it got so much colder. I am really hungry, so I'm gonna make some dinner and then prepare my bed. So this is the setup I use. I have a winter sleeping bag, I have a Thermarest Neo Light in small, and then I have my backpack beneath my feet and knees. I think that works just fine, but if it's cold I just put one of my outdoor jackets in it and then it's perfectly fine. And then a small pillow and a bunch of clothes and of course some chocolate. So while my water is heating up, I thought I would just answer the most common question I get when people see me camping in the snow. And that is, how do you stay warm? I've already showed you my winter sleeping bag, so in the night it's not a problem. I have my wool base layer, a hat. Uh, sometimes if it's really cold I have gloves because I love sleeping with my hands near my face so that they're not going to be in the sleeping bag. I also have really thick socks to keep my feet warm. I'm a really cold sleeper. Ooh, it's boiling. Wait a second. And in the evenings I keep my ski boots on, which are for really cold conditions. I usually change my gloves from the wet ones I've used during the day to uh, liners and then I have these super thick gloves that's for like minus 40 Celsius. I also have my normal wool, uh, not wool, down jacket. I have a shell jacket if I would want to go outside and it was windy. And then I have my wool mid layer as well. You don't have to have everything wool to stay warm, that's just what I prefer. It's also really good to get something warm into you, so like uh, a hot meal like this one, uh, like coffee or hot chocolate or something like, like that. Uh, it does wonders. And if you're getting chilly, then just run around the tents a few times, that also works. Wow, the moon is so beautiful tonight. I would normally have a tent this big when I was by myself, but I didn't have to walk that far this time, so I thought, why not have the extra space? I don't think that there is anything extreme about winter camping at all. As long as you have the right gear, the experience is pretty much the same as camping in any other conditions. Growing up in a society where an unnatural high level of comfort has become most people's standard, 
We have been fed the illusion that we need a house, a toilet, and constant entertainment in order to live. But all of these things are fairly new concepts compared to how long we humans have walked this earth. The people of the North have always dealt with the seasons, so it's not a problem for any of us either. Imagine how many other things there are that we have been conditioned to believe are impossible or not for us. How freeing it will be to realize that our imaginary cage was never locked in the first place. Keeping warm when you're skiing is never a problem. The problem is not sweating. <laughs> So I have now reached the forest and I'll soon be at my car. It's been really nice to get out and reconnect with nature a little bit. And you really appreciate all the comforts from home after nights like this. Thank you so much for watching this video and I really appreciate all your beautiful comments. I'll see you next time. Bye. Thank you.